Hey yo everybody, it's Omnidog here with an overview of Legion of Superheroes Five Years Later Volume 1 with my boy Pharaoh Lad right in the middle. Now this is strictly going to be an overview, just showing you what's in the book, what the art looks like, going through it, seeing if we can piece together uh, what's going on because I have not read this. I'm extremely interested in reading it because I love the Legion of Superheroes, uh, but it's going to be a surprise to me as well as you guys if you haven't seen it yet. So that's kind of, of a cool inner cover there. And I probably will remove the dust jacket to make most people happy. See, this is a very thick book, as you can see. It's, I'm going to have to go off camera to pull this off. Yes, look how this is. And let's take a look first at what kind of eye hole. It ha Whoop, there you go. That's pretty good. So you can see it's got sewn binding. It's very nice. And something interesting and doesn't happen very often for DC. So I'm going to make sure I mention it. Not only do they have uh, excuse me, while I try and be somewhat professional. Not only do they have a table of contents here with page numbers. So this book is from 1989 to about 19... I'm sorry. Yeah, 1989 to 1993. Um, page numbers and information. And in the book... Let's see if I can get this up here. Whoop. Can't see it, but here's a page number. There's page numbers to go along with the table of contents. That is really rare for DC, so I've given them credit. That looks great. And so here we go. Um, and let's see if we can figure out what happened five years. Are we five years later from what? There's the first cover. Five years later, foundation of the Legion's world has always been this, that the, the universe of the 30th century is a utopia, that crime, disease, war, and even death have largely been conquered. The humankind has reached a new golden age. A lot can change in five years. A war between science and magic caused a galactic upheaval that left the Legion without funding, without purpose, without support, without heart. And chaos reigned. Some Legionnaires have become renegades, some have been imprisoned, some are dead. Blah, 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 blah. Operating in a universe where there is no more order, gathering together former comrades who have grown out of the names boy, girl, lad, lass, and kid, he has a new legion to build. Ah, uh, let's see. Only one of the few remaining legion heroes remembers what it was all about, what the legion once represented. And if he succeeds, what can they hope to accomplish? There's only one way to find out. Join them. Okay, so magic and science battle it out. One legionnaire believes in the legion to try and get the universe back together. And this is, I would say, probably pretty typical 90s art. Nothing wrong with it. The colors, it's on glossy paper. So it's, I, I like glossy paper. I don't mind. Actually, I, I'm not a paper snob at all. I Whatever um, paper comes on, I'm happy with. So, But I, I, I do especially like um, glossy paper. So... This is a lot of 
interesting looking aliens since we are dealing with the Legion of Superheroes. I haven't seen very much Pharaoh Lad, but I'm also just sort of pawing through it just to see what we can see. And this, as I said, this is pretty thick. I, I think it's close to 1,400 pages. So you're going to need something extremely comfortable to set this on to read. So that's good. We also get covers along with our covers along with our page numbers and table of contents uh, I wonder what happened this must have slipped by the department of poor quality or something and somebody really really who is on their toes made this thing beautiful because it's got everything you want nice reproduction table of contents numbered pages the covers to the comic books themselves this is a high quality prod product kudos to dc and just so you don't think i'm anti-dc i am pro dc i grew up of course loving the legion uh, i grew up loving DC Comics, and I see them struggling in their collected editions department, and it breaks my heart when when uh, I feel like it, it would just take a few little quick fixes, and it could be done. But we will be glad that we have this. That's a cool border. This is a now what what's going on in this? Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Table. Uh, let me tell you what the contents are. It is Legion of Superheroes 1 through 39, Legion of Superheroes Annual 1 through 3, The Adventures of Superman 478, and Timberwolf 1 through 5. That's a cool picture. Uh oh. Dark side. And Lobo. Okay. Now you have my attention. So, so you can see we've I've gone through quite a bit and we still have a lot of it to go through. Uh, 
is this? Requiem, special to the interstellar press. This is interesting. So and then we come to the end where it's the Timberwolf specials, a character I know nothing about, so I will find out. Some of you out there may already know about him, and some of you may not. This is going to take a while to read, but I am really looking forward to it because I need to get up to date from all I know is Bouncing Boy and Matter Eater Lad so and Princess Projecta and things like that. So... I think this book looks like it's going to be really good. And I'm very interested in finding out about it. So there you go. That's an overview of Legion of Superheroes five years later. I still didn't see any feral out in there. Hmm. But this has been uh, Omnidog. Thank you for tuning in. If you could give me a like, please subscribe. Feel free to comment. And uh, as always, peace and love, peace and love.